Good evening everybody and welcome to the Potter's Resorts 2022 World Indoor Bowls Championships live from Hopton on Sea. As you can see we have a great game coming up for you this evening. And we're going to hand you now over to the commentary team from the BBC. Thank you very much Jason. Yes, the player that we have out first for this singles match is ranked number 18 in the world. A former World Championship semi-finalist, he holds several national titles including indoors, mixed fours, triples and pairs. Please welcome out Wayne Wilgress. Good evening everybody and welcome to the Potter's Resorts 2000. several national titles. He's a former Commonwealth gold medalist and previous World Pairs and Mixed Pairs champion. Please give a big warm welcome. Ranked number 16 in the world, it's Simon Skelton. People just making their way to their seats at the moment, so the players just holding on for just a second or two. They'll be coming in uh, probably over the next 20 minutes or so, I would expect, so there'll be a little bit of disruption, but not too much. Jack length, 24 metres. Interesting game, this seated player, Simon Skelton. Been around the game a long, long time. Had his ups and downs on the portable rink. Big lad, but all a very smooth delivery. Do well done to Scarlet Smith. Good front row. Yeah, he's a bit of a unit this way. Gonna tackle him. Watch him walking down the green there, thinking, tell you what, that coming at you at 20 miles an hour could be a bit scary. Yeah. He could run around me, I wouldn't be stopping him. <laughs> when you see him driving as well, he can really push a ball down the rink. The a very, very on your bowl, player. One inch. Am I? Fourteen. Uh, Wayne won the Bromley qualifier. Quick carpet there in Bromley. Played some really good bowls to win it. Yes, he was very unlucky last year. He qualified to the quarter-final stage and uh, tested positive. It was one of our, our COVID tests and just had to leave. And uh, his opponent as well tested positive. So, uh, fortunately, the both of them just had to uh, leave the event. It was good to see him qualifying back in, to get back in again. Very nice opening. by Simon Skelton. Oh, 
overplayed that just on the outside line. Didn't want to be short. No, but it's yes. virtually the same ball, John, and he's only got one on the head, which doesn't help him if he's thinking about attacking it. Simon Skelton's done well. He dropped out of the top. 16 for a while and made his way back in. He's done very, very well. He gets a lot of credit from people for doing that. I, I am one of the people who thinks that he's done extremely well because that's hard going to go through the qualifiers. Yeah, staying with the draw, Wayne. Didn't want to attack it and remove his closest ball. <laughs> Better for weight. Yep. Needs to be really good on the weight. Cross. Yep. The crowd getting behind him. He's got a, a few supporters in here tonight. Come on, please. Yeah, going to get a tape on this. Measure for shot. Measure number one, that's a really good delivery. <laughs> Down below, it'll sort it out. One shot, right. Simon Skelton. Zero, first step. I think Simon thought he was lying because he had a quick look and then he stood back waiting. You remember years ago, Simon used to have a, a delivery. It sort of bumped and wiggled its way away. And then in the last lot of years, he's really smoothed that out and uh, he's playing very well. I don't know what he's done, but... Track back to 25 and a half at it Over the years and certainly a different delivery than what he used to have. Started well, Simon. This is what he needs to do. He's got to try and get close to the jack. He wants to really get Wayne playing the attacking balls. Wayne is very good at them, but of course you don't want to be doing too many in a game, do you, Dave? You want to be keeping your own drawing game going. For both players. One green. Settled into it, no doubt about that. Opportunity to practice beforehand. It's a good, it's a good time to play, John, because you do have that practice time. You don't have to wait. Although generally as the, the match progresses, the ring can change just a little bit. Well, that 
doesn't help the shot that Simon was maybe thinking about. No, it just covers that line in. It's still there. If it's on the outside line, good weight, you'll draw around that ball. The weight has to be perfect on this hand. Now we're in. That's not a place for us. There you go. Having we look at it from the other side as the ball drops in. Certainly found the right line, but just over the weight. Good end of both, though. All in the line, good weight. Be a little careful, Wayne. You doesn't drop onto the jack, fall back against it. Seen that happen a few times today. Yes, it's a common feature. He's giving it a go. Some try. Good try again. One shot, Wayne Wilgress. Score one one off the two ends. Six meters. Eighteen inch gap. Be interesting towards the end of this game if um, Wayne Willigris has to play some of the big bowls that he, he's well known for, the big heavy weight shots, the conversion shots. Started well on the draw though. I think he's maturing as a player, Wayne, since I first saw him. To use that drive a little more sparingly now, David. He doesn't go quite as early. Very controlled in his game. Yes, a lot of young players involved in the heavy shot play early. Good effort. Could be. One red. Yes, it's a shot. Over a period of time. Get those rough edges taken off and they mature into very, very good players. It's just a matter of if they can get a run on things and then Wayne's getting closer and closer. Just needed to drop that ball down, he wasn't far away. Good quality though, both players. Those balls are a big bias on them. 
Yeah, got a good swing in there. Simon Skelton off the wide line. May may tempt Wayne into a bit of weight on this. Wayne Move that ball into the jack. Yeah. Front ball doesn't help. That's a bit of a hindrance, but. And that, that changes the weight, John, because he can't come thundering down. He's going to have to play some sort of a controlled weight at this, and, and that's not very appetizing at all. Target's a bit bigger on the forehand, less chance of taking his own two balls out on the forehand. Backhand, if it holds off, he might just get his two green balls, and that's that wouldn't be good. He's going reasonably big. Front pole solid is good. Yeah, it's got it on the side. Yeah, it was always a bit of a protector, wasn't it? It was. It was always an awkward ball to get past. The right shot, though, on the forehand. for the third, just hasn't made it. So, good play. One away, one conceded. <laughs> Two shots, Simon Skelton. already said that the other ball was in, so... Players so score three happy one, to have three. Look. Yeah, always looked a likely two shots for Simon Skelton. Twenty-five meters. One red. Small adjustment there by Will Gress. Good ball. It's good bowling, there's no doubt about that, but Simon's just edging it. Not by much.
It's a disappointing, disappointing ball for Wayne Wilgress. He didn't want to be there. Well down the green. Playing the two balls on his backhand side. High and wide. Yeah, once, once you go on that wide side, it just doesn't get back. He really just two needed to shave his own front ball. And it's once again, it's another situation where the, the front balls are killing him. Set score 5 1 after four rounds. Very solid start by Simon Skelton. That's what he needed. length 24 meters staying with this short length Simon playing very well to it another great opener again Finding that pressure. He's just winning that battle, isn't he, John? And just forcing things a little bit. Very good reply. <laughs> he's not playing badly at all, and he's playing well, but Simon's just got that little bit. In front. Line in, he's got a reach though. Pretty good effort. One red. Really good effort. Still one to red though.
see Simon was just trying to draw a little bit heavy jump, but Eden Bowl on the jack probably wouldn't have been the worst in the world simply because that would have taken all the danger away. Yeah, that's right, David. I mean, Wayne's still got a shot, you know, onto his green bowl. Well, he would ideally like to get the split, take the red bowl out and not touch the jack. So he's playing. He's inside it, though. He's well inside it. One shot, Simon Skelton. Goes away very quickly, but Simon Skelton's building up a very tidy lead here. Really good balls by Wayne again there, but... The problem is that he's being forced into playing those little weight shots. And that's keeping the Wayne Wilgris support quite quiet. Four and a half meters. <coughs> Shot clock doesn't apply for the first ball. sneaked in in front. <laughs> See him again, just sneaked up in front, yeah. maybe. Fell back. Yeah, just dropped back. bit further, just trying to get in front of that red. Run out of gas. That's pretty close to whose line. Could be two green, it could be one red. Five round one. Thank you. Wait with this, he gets past, he's really good. Yeah, he's played it well. Good example of a strong bass ball. You're able to get around the short ball. stuff, not worry about it. Well, really good draw there by Simon Skelton. Three inches and it's short fallen down high. now, that ball. David is fallen just down in front of the jack. Gonna play weight at this. Yeah, I think he has to open it. Jack gone, where's the, the balls? Well, Jack's in the side rink, side ditch. Go on the respot position now. Yep, there it is. You can lift it up in the respot. Well he's opened it up, Wayne will dress, hasn't he? He's given himself a, a bit of a bit of room. I'm hoping now that Simon doesn't get too close. Well he really needs to win this and John to be fair, it's um 6-1, stretching away a little bit here. Ah. 
sure if he's too happy with this. Oh, he's just struggling to get there. Yeah, secured the shot, but not close enough. About five feet away, and he'll know that's just not enough. Now this is a must-get opportunity for Wayne Wilgress. He can't afford to mess up on this. He needs to draw the shot, David. Yep. Very good opportunity to get get one back. Well, he's got five feet all round the jack, so there's plenty of room. He's not too wide by any means. He's struggling for the width more than the weight. Oh dear, that's. That is just not there. One shot, Simon Skelton. Yeah. Yeah, that's a bad miss. He had a big opportunity to get that one. Oh, the hit and the draw is, 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 is you know, for the top six guys, six. is pretty standard stuff, John. But, you know, you had five feet to the inside of the jack, the front, the back. You know, he had a lot of room. And, um, you know, it's 6 2, three ends to go. You're thinking, I'm right in this. I'm still, I'm still fighting, but uh, it's going to be a lot harder now. Track length, 23 and a half metres. Simon likes this short jack length. Yeah, that's why Wayne needed the shot last time. Get, get off this length to go a bit longer. Be playing good first bowls to this length. Simon Skelton, he's on the line again. It's a strange old game, isn't it? That was out the previous end, nothing near it. Can't get within five feet, and the next end, they're both within inches of the jack. I appreciate the jack was, you know, off center and everything else, John, but it was a big opportunity. Disappointment of that last ball in the previous end. Oh, well, not agree that, but this is on Simon's jack length. The score line, he'll probably just stick with the draw, but there's no, no, there's no really no point in starting to run at things. Start losing twos and threes, and if the jack goes out, just try and get a good second. Very close for shot. Very close. Oh, Side yeah, yeah. Super ball, that is. One red. Got a bit between his teeth tonight, Simon Skelton. Yeah, he's playing well. Yeah. Needs to have good weight to get back. He's in with a chance with this. Needs the jack. Well, he's got it, and he's got the shot back. This is really good play. Yeah, One great three. ball again there. He's going again on the backhand. I thought he might be tempted with the forehand to get his own ball under the jack. Mm. 
bit surprised at that, John. There was a natural way in on the forehand to get to the green ball. Yeah, could have used the green ball to the side as well. A little catch there, but he played such a good ball with his third one. I, I really think he, he thought he could do it again. A confident mood on the draw. Yep. Good line in. Just got a bend. Yeah, his weight was very, very good actually. Because you could afford to rest into the green ball, even carrying a foot or so. Yeah, yeah. One shot, Wayne Rook, Wilgress. Set score 7 2 after 7 ends. It's one shot, but he really needed a double there, John, because. You know, with, with two ends to go, he's really having to chase it now in this end eight. Yeah, it's, it's uh, realistically, he'd be looking for a three this end. To give himself a chance then going to the last. And the way the game has Jack gone, the heads have been good, David. It's hard to get a, a three or a four, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. Immediately added four meters onto the jack length. Yeah, I think he needed to make that change on the length. Let's try and shake Simon off his game a little bit. Just snatched at that a little bit, Simon. Didn't get it away Last quite as clean as he's been doing so in this game. Green. Yeah, he sort of grimaced a little yeah. bit on the delivery, and um, the players know themselves. There's something wrong with this, he thinks. And I have a feeling that he is. Actually getting a bit further than what he thought, but it's still two feet short. I think he realised that. Yeah, he knew that and he let it go. That was the one to close it down, John. Front toucher, close it down, put the pressure on Simon, looking for a three in this end. He's left the door open for Simon to put one really close. Perhaps he missed his chance. He has now. Two green. This is really important to get this one in. Yes, he's got to get to the jack here. I'm going to give Simon an op opportunity. Oh. Needs this one to pull back really quickly. Well, he's made the three, John, and I suppose, you know, if anything, he wanted that ball slightly short of the jack, but he's still got the pressure on there. There's plenty of room, but... Yeah, it's got to, you know, it's got to be beat, the three shots, but it's there. Open draw in. He's certainly a lot more interested in this one. So he should be. His weight's good, it's just whether he's going to hold enough. Uh, he's going to drop probably down to second shot. He's losing at least one, I think. <laughs> <laughs> I 
They can have one, Simon said. Yeah, I think he might be looking for more than one. One and a look. Uh, one and a look for the other two. So. Yeah. This could be a bit tricky. He has to try and the umpire has to try and move this out of the way. One conceded. Yeah. You know, Dan Blute will uh, one green and try and remove the closest green ball without the other ones moving in any way. So he has to be very, very careful. Yeah, it's an important measure because there's a big difference in a single shot for Wayne Wilgress and the three. Simon has got second shot, that's a good result for him. A little chocks on the ball just to hold it. Oh, that's well in. Yeah, well in. That's well in, there's a chance of the other one. Still be the three. This one's much closer in terms of the measure. He has to go back and check to make sure that the measure hasn't moved, and then he'll push out the shots. Looking for, and he's been pretty close a few times to getting it. Three shots, Wayne Wilgress. Suddenly he's now in with a, seven, a, five, a bit of a sniff seven. in this uh, first set. One end to go, 7 5, two shots down. Yeah, certainly he's given himself an opportunity now on this last end of the set. Simon will be annoyed with himself though, he had a few chances, there, two or three exactly. chances Can't really to draw in there and kill it off. Yeah, yeah, he really should be starting the, uh, be in a situation of actually just starting the next set. Simon will be aware of that. Starter. here. Han just holds on a little bit, so he might be okay with this. Yeah, that elder line. Um, it's going to fall off, but One still red. in the area. Simon's played a really good first ball. His, his own ball's half locked in with a back green one. Not a good second one here, though. He's down no. the green. No, that's not good. Shake the head and really, Wayne needs this one in because if he's going to have any chance to, to get a draw out of the set, he needs a number one shot, this ball. That's an inside road. He's very oh. tight with that. Oh. That is so tight, it's unreal. He completely missed the line, and his weight wasn't even that great either. No, that's that's yeah. He knows. I to tell. It's almost like he tried to steer that one into a line, John. It's giving Simon Skelton all sorts of chances here to close this out.
Well, it's still there for Wayne. Same line with his first ball on that backhand, the drawing line, turn the jack for two. Yeah, it's, it's worth reaching, there's no doubt about that. You know, it, it doesn't matter if it goes back a fair distance. Time. But Wayne has three timeouts remaining. The, the problem he has, John, is the weight he needs to use. It's, it's hard, you know, it's very difficult just to trail that jack two feet. Mm. I think I have two seconds. Wow. Is he going for the edge? It's certainly, that can't be two seconds, surely. Well, from our position, it's yes. Wow, close. Said, I don't know. Mm -hmm. It's he's saying there's two seconds, but maybe if he misses the jack and gets to the edge of the red ball, that's enough. But distances don't look good to me. The angles look even worse. He's going to have to cut it out clean, and yeah. it's not so easy. That is. Well, it'll half lock in with a back green one. Oh, he's playing for it. He's not that far away from it either. Needs a jack solid. Oh, he's, well, well, no, it's in the dead. So I was going to say, if that goes on the re-spot, it's probably better. But uh, it hasn't stayed in the dead. So we're on the re-spot. At least he had two shots you know, within five feet. And they can be missed. Three green. But, uh, so far away. Well, Simon's not worried about the shot, is he? No. Got to beat no, the second, second ball, shot. which is a long way away. Yeah. yeah. Nerve King sitting there waiting for his next match. Wife Suzanne. Was he far enough with this? He has to clear the front one. Is he clearing it? I don't think he is. Oh, my goodness oh, me. My not goodness. only that. Unbelievable. But he's lost the set. Unbelievable. And there's Wayne Tran, he's waving the crowd to get up. Look at this. You're going to get that reaction from Wayne. He played a big ball, but to win the set from that, John, that is just... Three shots in the first set, Wayne Wilgress. Wow. Look at the reaction, man. I mean, I want to say that last ball with Simon. That was criminal not to get past that. Well, he knows it. He knows it, like it's... Look at the reaction. <laughs> you have to love Wayne, don't you? <laughs> Just get right into it, he says. <laughs> Simon, well, you know, you have to accept that's just happened sometimes, but he was second best for the majority of that set. Well, Simon loses the next set. Be, uh, or draws the next set, it'll be a long drive home thinking about that one. Yeah, well, he got out of jail there, definitely waiting on that set. Last two ends. Oh. Chances that Simon had to close it Jack down on the eighth end, chances he had to close it down again. I didn't think he played a bad end there. Uh, Local lad there. Yeah, I, I think he's got a season's wrong now. Got a canary's mask on, I think, Dave. He's, uh, somebody he's, should say to yeah. him that it's the middle of winter. Yeah, he's happy with that result, with uh, the set with Wayne. It's uh, better than Norwich City have been doing this season. I wasn't really going to go there, bearing in mind that we're in Norfolk. I just thought I'm going to let that one slide, John. <laughs> Yep, he's pumped, isn't he? His reaction at that one was enough to <laughs> tell him that. Yeah, well, he's getting himself up now. Obviously, he was, uh, he was a bit flat in the early stages of that set, but he's fired up now. Look at that face. Yeah, but what's interesting is what reaction was Simon Skelton because he really let that first set get away from him. It should have been over in eight ends. Ended up losing it. Good. Last bowl, nine inches short of Jack High. He has to quieten the crowd down, doesn't he? Well, he was going along very nicely in, in the first set, but he's, he's got them going now. Yeah, it's a bit like you know, Wayne has scored a goal in Fergie time. 
to win the set. We're going to be talking about football a bit. It's just what it felt like. Another good goal in the area. One green. He's sticking with the backhand. I thought he might have swapped sides then. Well, it, it looks better on the forehand. He's obviously very comfortable here, but there's that danger of turning the red ball. He's passed it, he's well played, he just drops past the red. Oh, he's played this one. Man's on fire at the moment. Yeah, it's just amazing what a big ball can do for you, but also if the opposition allows you. Two green. Now Simon Skelton's got a ball very close, and he's two down. Might be playing a little weight shot here. It's got to be worth arriving at it. Yep, playing it. And he's interested. Needs a good result, needs a good contact. Well, that's brought it out into the open, and that will go on the respot. Normal player, player would lift a jack and put it onto the respot, but here, they just let the officials do their job. One shot, maybe two, but I think it's one. Yeah, they're a long way away. <laughs> long that doesn't way count for anything, does it? Yeah. <laughs> All right, I know you're going to say that. <laughs> you opened the door on that yeah, one, mate. Yeah. Yeah. I'm, I'm going to bite on that one. But seriously, <laughs> Wayne's going to need to get closer yeah, to hold the shot here. He is. He's got a good line. Yep, certainly has. Has he pushed it, though? Still running. Well, it's not bad. Uh, it's got to be beat. No, it's not bad. This is a test for Simon Skelton just to keep his uh, composure. Front inside edge of the mat to make sure he holds the ball up as much as possible. Well, again, he's on a decent line as well. Happy, I think Looks, he's flying with he's, this. He's tracking on this. I'm could, not even sure if he'll save second shot. Could lose the ball. Oh. Well, he might have saved second, but that's. Oh dear me, that was a long way away. Wow. Now looking at it, might need a rope to sort this one out. Yeah. Conceded. Yes, one, one, <laughs> one green and a measure. Well, he's conceding one, that's a gift. Yeah. <laughs> Take that one away. And uh, we'll get the long measure on to the next one. <laughs> Feels it's just the one, Simon, he says just the one. Well, in. well, yeah, Wayne was a bit shot, optimistic looking for two there, I think. Uh, you know, I think he'd be happy to get the shot. Might have been a bit psychological that to measure that. Zero one, first end. Might have been, but I don't think so. I think it was just over that sort of distance. It's hard, John. out into a highly entertaining game, hasn't it? It was yep. good bowling right yep. from the start, to be yep. fair. It's been good good stuff all the way through. Length 27 and a half metres. Had a bit of everything. Like a little bit of edge to it as well. Oh, I love that. We, we don't have enough of that. 
used to be a few edgy characters when uh, when we were playing John. The ball standard has been good here as well. Just on that last end that it that set that Simon went to walk about for that last ball. Keeping himself together though, isn't he? Yeah, normal service resumed by that. Yep. Good ball. And he's sticking to that side and it looked like a natural forehand shot. One red. Yeah, you think you play the forehand way, Will Dress now. Any movement on the jack yeah. is good. Turn the red away. Certainly thinks he's heavy. You know, he's not far away from this. Well, that's help. He's, he's opened up the target a little bit. Yeah, he's loosened the jack from the ball. Needs to get a, a good ball in here, Simon. He's vulnerable at the moment. Ball in the end. This is good. That's very good. No, oh, it's really good. The uh, back toucher there. That ball could have been removed so easily. Too red. Well, he's put the disappointment of that first set away. He's done well. Wayne is very pumped up, and the crowd are getting behind him. Chains to go for this. He has. Yeah, he's attacking this. Wow. I don't fancy that shot much. I think that was damage limitation. Get it out. Hope to be landing the shot and let Simon draw one. Comfortable two to red. Chance to add another. Girlfriend. Wasn't the easiest spare That's shot opportunity with the last ball, but made it look easy. Yeah, well played there. Very good three. Four and a half meters. short jack links doesn't he yeah that's what he was controlling the first set to that sort of six end point really on that length david getting good first balls in we'll reply again Get 
Interesting choice to play the backhand here. Played it well. Yeah, that's good. I wonder will we and wait here or just go for it now? Go early. Two balls to come after this. Well, if it's One two round. shots, he will. Last definitely. Ball Last ball is... It can't be worse off, Dave, high. if he's two down. Well, even if he hits his own ball, he's going to take one away. Yeah. I, I think he really, yeah, he should go for this. I think he is. Yeah, on target. There we go. Bye-bye. Yeah, he's got the run through as well, I think, to the spot position. He has. Let's see where this goes down now. He's going to be close to it. He's going to be about 10 inches away from it on the run through. Here it goes. That's the ball he struck with. Yep. Right the crowd just realising how close he is to it. Simon, surely he's not playing the backhand, is he? Well, I thought he'd come across the rink on the forehand side. <laughs> he fancies the line there yep. on the backhand. Well, with this side is he's always coming away from the jack. He's not coming in towards it. Yeah, he's, not yeah, he's not there. And one green. Surprised at that. On the forehand, he had a chance to catch the green ball. Can't see Wayne playing that side. I think he'll come across on the forehand. More room to come in. No, he's persevering with the backhand as well. There must be something that there's a problem coming across the rink. Has he pushed this? Still coming down. Well, if it is, it's only just going to sneak in front, but not by much. Maybe, but I uh, must change onto the forehand, surely. Well, degree of difficulty now passing that ball on the backhand as well. One in a measure. Wow. Sticking with it, and they're trying to adjust the weight. He's pushed it out, played across his body, should hold the length, but it's still struggling, in my opinion. No, it's not getting there. And he's going to drop his own ball out. I think it could be two shots now. Surely you can't do a win. You must play the four. Well, sticking with it. Yeah, he's not going to find a couple of feet. So there has to be a reason for this. He certainly, uh, if he has more wit, he's good, but he's struggling. Uh, I, I think they've made this hard for themselves, I really do. That's four balls that really should have been a lot closer. I think that was Wayne Wilgrace, it's not a wolf in there. In the <laughs> he, he's mooing a little bit at the... Uh, <laughs> thought it was a full, full moon, Dave. Yeah. Oh, exactly. Why? Why on earth did they play the backhand? It was, you know, there's a jack high ball on the forehand, the red one. Just, just play across the line. Yeah, I thought that was a target ball. You got inside that, you're going to count comfortably if you're Wayne Wilgress. Okay. You know, that's the ball there. They're measuring. That's the target ball. <laughs> it's a weird, weird world sometimes. But it is Wayne's world, so there yeah, you go. Yeah, I, th I think at the end of the day, he's, he's played what he thought he could draw on that backhand side. But the, the, certainly, I felt the easier ball was to come across the rink, Dave. I, I just don't understand it. But I say there might be a reason for it that we are not aware of. Yeah. Oh, I think he's made it. At least with one of them. Yeah. Well. Two shots, Wayne Wilgress. It may not be a perfect world, but it's a decent world. Because yeah, he's he got, got a couple out of it. He's got the two shots out of it, partly due to Simon dropping that ball back, didn't he? he fell against the short yep. ball and dropped Sesco it out. Three, three after three ends. <laughs> it's a very strange game, this. 
a few of the players have been watching these matches back in their own rooms and <laughs> they must be thinking to themselves this is this is not uh, not quite the normal way of playing jack length 27 and a half meters He's got a lovely smooth delivery. Look at that. Gets the ball away really well. First ball, he's been very good with his first ball in this match. Just missed a, unfortunately for him, he missed a couple of ends that were crucial. No bad attempt, good second again. Good second, even more so because it came away from center rink, John, so he can see the ball on Jack. Doesn't want to fall back on the Jack here. That's okay. Favour only one. And he's just sent this a little bit further. To get to the jack. Oh, he's just pulling up again. Not the love way in what he says, anyway. <laughs> He's obviously a healthy eater because he says uh, food, favourite food, anything without vegetables. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> no veggies. Time out. Simon has four timeouts remaining. He's a hunter gatherer. That's a hunter gatherer, isn't he? Forehand, you he's looking for a yeah. cover ball. I, the way Wayne plays, he, he, he attempted to ping these two red balls away and hope that the jack doesn't get a contact on the jack. Yeah, but if he yeah. does get a contact on the jack, he could be even worse off. One red and a measure. It's one and a measure, and if he thinks it's only one, he'll just draw it off. Well, he must favour it's two. He's playing he's going it. For it. Looking for the two balls. Looking for the two balls. Yeah! And that's what you're saying, John. He was hoping to miss the jack, and that's there he goes. Get the crowd going. Come on. Give me applause. That was brilliant. Yeah, I thought, I know the way he played. I thought he'd have a go at that. Too green. He looked at the plant and he looked at the way they were laying and he, he felt he could hit it. He got it. Mike Simon just had a, a wee look there at the crowd as if to say, just you know, calm yourselves. <laughs> We in support. Still a ball to come. The movement. Well, yep. There's. Uh, we have a slight problem in uh, in the crowd. So they're uh, they're calling for the medics to make their way up. Well, that's a bad time for that to happen. I know it's never a good time, if but. You want uh, to play all white. Have to stop now on the mat. Okay, 
Yeah, he's going to play the shot here, I think, and then we can take a, a slight break. He's going for the jack here, John. Two balls or the jack. He's running it. He's looking for the jack. Close to it. Doesn't want the hole. Oh, oh, oh he got a toucher. Oh, unbelievable. Me. Well, he could have played that 20 times and knock on down that gap, Dave. Oh, what a bad result. That was really unlucky. Oh, dear, oh dear. Moved it by a millimetre. Two shots. Two shots, Wayne Wilgress. Well, there... There's help on hand, so they might just take a few seconds yeah. or two. A short technical timeout. Yeah. That makes sense, to be honest. There's a short technical timeout. Probably not the best for Wayne because he's... It's on a roll. He is. He is on a roll, but... Um, and he certainly work in the audience. He's getting them behind him. I think that's deliberate. Oh, of course. Absolutely. And so he should. Yeah. No, you have to. It's the same in a football match, John. You're looking for that home support. You want it to go there. You, you can go to a lot of. Uh, well, you know, if you're if you're going down to the local, uh, your club, you no, know, you're relying on the crowd to give play you that resuming. extra. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Play resuming. So just a moment or two. Play is resuming. They've got it in hand. Set score three. Yeah, five, I don't think it was too eight. serious. Whatever happened there, Dave. They've got it sorted. Little stumble, I think, in the stand. Yes, possibly. Than that. Possibly, it's uh, tournament director Tom Weir's uh, got it all sorted by the looks of it. He's going to have a quick word, I think, with the marker and the umpire. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Take your seats. Play will continue. Yeah. Good. Off and running again. Hopefully, all will be well. <laughs> Goodness me, we're getting everything in this game, weren't we, John? Good entertainment. Absolutely. You know, just missing that jack. Oh my well, goodness me! So bad luck there. That was really so oh. close, wasn't it, Simon Skelton? Brave shot to take on, and I thought he had played it to perfection. thinks he's a little bit over it. I don't know, I think he's not bad. Yes, it's actually running more than what I thought. A couple of feet behind. Good again. Goodness me, he's played a lot of really good first balls, hasn't Touches, he? Touches, isn't it? Yeah, really top class first balls. Take a look at the stats at the end of this game. Just over it. Good ball there, though. One. Swap under the forehand, you try and draw the shot, I think. No, he's playing it. Very aggressive. He's got something. Uh, he was always taking his own if he didn't get the jack. And once you miss the jack and got the other bullet, he had to take his own out. Giving himself a bit more room, but it's not going to be easy after a full drive. He'll be facing two down. What he would think. Oh, didn't like that. He knew he needed the jack. It's 
stalk in this bowl. Simon Skelton. Well, the only thing he doesn't want to do is put it beside the other red ball. Two red. Got to be tempting. Got to be. Yeah, well, he's driven with the third ball. Might very well play it again. Risky, obviously. If he misses it, he's going to lose a three. But if he gets it, well, the most he can lose is one. Playing it. Oh, he's missed that. He just didn't get it away right. It actually left his hand just a fraction early, John. You know, you could actually see that on the delivery. It, it just moved a fraction early. Yeah, just didn't get it, it away. Didn't get it away clean. Didn't get it away smoothly. And, uh, well, didn't have to watch it for too long to know that was going to miss. And that's a very, I can't say it's a soft three any means but add three to lose yep no mistake three shots Simon Skelton oh. set score six five after five ends two trebles in the second set Going to score, score big. Should be a short jack length. Looking for about 24 and a half, somewhere around there. Jack length 24 yeah, and a half. He's been playing well to that length, Simon, all game. Yeah. And he's been good with the jack. Been rolling the jack down at a, at a consistent distance. Not always easy. See this picture that how much the balls are pulling in off the bias. They're going a lot wider than people realize. Close again. this length so well. Oh, he has to follow it, yes. He can't play the forehand there. Oh, that's a bit wider. wait for the job but One needs round. to narrow it down interesting thought he might have just tried to tap his own ball down John and, and lock it into the green one didn't want to get the jack though did he Dave yeah that's where the danger is useful ball there degree of value about that one about this whether to go early danger is taking his own ball out only one down oh, he's missed it and searching for that little tight line that is there John but it's very hard to find you see I, I think you just got to try and draw to the jack Dave you can't think about trying yep. to get the inside roller to move something yes, don't don't 
go fishing for yeah. it. Just put it down the draw line, and if you get back, you get back, yeah. and leave it at that. If you're going to play that, that's the way to play it. But I think Wayne uh, was tempted to be a little more aggressive on that. Yeah. Going deep here, look for the spot yeah. position. I think very deliberate. I can't blame him after the last few ends. Yeah. You know, in this game, there's been things that you don't think Wayne will have a bash at, but he does. And um, this could be another one of the ends where he tries to play weight to it. But this is an interesting shot in the forehand. He needs to reach. Wasn't really positive. One shot, two yeah, it's was difficult. He didn't have a lot of position there. I still think the shot was probably on the backhand just to draw to try and nudge the jack. A little bit of breathing space, 7 5, but at six ends in the last set, Simon Skelton was up seven shots to one. And lost it. Two threes at the end, and eight and end nine. So. A lot of balls we've played the next three ends. Kept the crowd interested. Track length 24 and a half metres. It's consistent, isn't he? Yeah, Jack. good Jack throwing. That's where he wants to be. Was expecting this to be close. <laughs> it is. Like that side as well. Forehand side getting a big swing there. Yeah, just under. Lovely line, just under for the weight. So, <laughs> a cough on delivery there. It's not doing where you get a cough in the crowd, John. It's uh, going to put you off. But that type of environment. Got that wide line again. Yeah, he needs to run. Will he get past? Tempting for the two green. A runner at this, take the two by, balls out. Drum plant could do damage as well. Well, he thinks he's close. And he is. Oh, he just got it solid. Transferred all the weight through the first ball he hit onto the second one. And it stayed in. Yeah, very unfortunate. Dan. Good strike on it. I think Wayne will look to get another one in you. Give it some company. Trying again. Touch it down, that would be good. Uh, the two balls are going again, but not only that, that One brings green. that front plant into, into play for the jack now, and he knows it. Really, Simon looks to play the same ball as he did yep. with his third. He's going to get a result. He's on the same line with the same weight. Two balls are going to disappear. 
at the front plant now, John. There's a chance it might just make the right connection. Yeah, the better connections are two greens two, away, though, yeah. isn't it? Two balls. That's a primary hit, primary target. Has he pushed this out? Get back off the wide when he's got a chance. Yeah. Oh, unlucky. He just didn't get back. He pushed it out very One slightly. Slightly higher than his last delivery. Yep, definitely. Very nearly made it back, to be fair, but just looked a little bit wider. Seventh end. You want to be scoring on this end, and he's not happy with this one. Oh, I don't know. He's still coming there, Dave. Not that far away. I tell you what, he's not that far away. I don't know about being not happy with that. <laughs> Work that one out. The trouble is that he didn't think he was there. And he was that's there, seven, so seven, <laughs> that's what the smile is about. Simon has three timeouts remaining. Six and a half meters. Only a couple of meters longer, but it will change the lines a little bit. Yeah, and it just made a difference in that first set when Wayne Lent did. He got back in the, the first set on the longer jack. When Sam Nall, everything to play for in this set now. And Mark Dawes is waiting for the winner. That will be a bit tasty against Dawsy. Again by Simon, just needs to run a little bit further. Nailed the line. Hold one. <laughs> False start there for Wayne. Just going to settle himself down. See what the problem is. It must be heavy, and it is. Yeah, got distracted a little bit. The concentration yep. went. He did settle himself down, change bows, but the time out might have been useful. Whoever moved in the crowd, uh, it looks there. good. Kill, David. You wouldn't want oh. him giving you that look, would you? <laughs> uh, you'd be down the road. <laughs> Wouldn't like to be a wing <laughs> on the rugby field, mate. Without waiting for me, <laughs> I just don't think so. Uh, Simon stepping in here, another close ball. Yeah, played it well. <laughs> the thing is, if Simon scores a single here, he still has to win the last end. This doesn't look right either. Said that last end, David. It trundling in. Look at this again. That's a good second and that'll do him at the moment. I, I'm not sure if he, sometimes when he put in, he's putting the ball down, if he knows he's going to be close or not. Normally the players do, John, but you know, a click of the finger something usually indicates there's something not right. How 
How many times? Uh, we could play the same Three. similar ball way, Milgris. Foot away, just squeeze the jack, he's turn got the a red away. Here. Yeah. yeah. So just use it. You know, he's plenty of timeouts. Use them now. Adds 30 seconds to the the 30 seconds he's got. So it's not really a problem. Uh -huh. in that there it goes. Add another Wait, 30 seconds on the original 30. Maybe. You've got 60 seconds. Plenty of time. Instead of the normal 30 seconds, you've got a minute and a half to play the ball. And I think something similar does last, to be honest, John, because, you know, as I said, if Simon gets one, he still has to win the last yeah. end. And if he plays a really good ball, he's so close to it with his third ball, Wayne. If he does get the, just to the red and drops it away or squeezes the jack. He has to think about this, and I hope he's remembered the situation. One shot is not a disaster. Simon, OK, he's given Simon a chance for another one, but... Playing the draw, he's looking yeah. to just reach it, squeeze the jack, squeeze it right away. Oh, he's just been a bit too keen yeah, and he's overplayed. Sure didn't need that. that weight, I don't think. No, he didn't. That, that really, he, that was a deliberate weighted shot and he should have been just drawing to it. You know, he dropped off his own green ball, it was good enough. I'm surprised at that, you know, it's. Simon looking for a, a second, which would be really very, very good. Not a force yeah, like to make this. Well, force his way into scoring a, you know, a double in the last end. And it's just not coming back. The weight was really good. One shot. One shot. <laughs> I think for Wayne is he can play this like a tie break end. Because he needs to get the shot. And he's a pacing about like a caged tiger he down there. Right. He can't wait to get oh, going. Yeah, he's, he's, he's all movement, isn't he? Been a good game, both players though. Good entertainment for the crowd. Good quality balls played. That's when you were hoping for a close ball there, Simon. He's played so many good ones. <laughs> yes. Just a little bit loose. Not a bad yeah, ball, but I just know. a little bit loose. We're, we're so used to him nailing the jack, aren't we, yeah. with that first ball at his own length. And he'll be thinking that. He'll be thinking all the, the close balls I've played, I'm just not quite tight in this. Now then, good line in with Wayne on this forehand again. Oh, Needs oh, to yeah. just run a little bit further. Yeah, it's not bad. Just pulled it across a little bit. Just looked a bit narrow. He's calling me. Well, another chance for a close one. Urging the ball down, Wayne. Needs it a run. Urging it down. Not getting there, though. Mm, not quite, and that's, well, that was a good chance because that really would have put the pressure on. He knows it's just not close enough. Persevering with this backhand, Simon. Turn his body to try and get it back in again, but it's still holding. Is that enough? No, it's not. And this is this is the crunch time now, John. 
Yeah, I thought he might have gambled earlier to change sides even after the second ball to go onto the yeah. forehand side. It's not easy to get in there. If he pulls his line in right. on Goodweight, he'll he, dive away. Wayne, Wayne's got a couple of he's got a couple of timeouts. Use one. This is this is potentially the last end. Well, he's got a forehand draw, and he's just going to try and drop past this, I think. And yeah, five or six seconds, and but this is crucial. If he gets this close, the pressure is right on. Certainly further. Oh. Certainly further. He's waving at it. It's a closer bowl. It's a wing bowl, though, on the forehand. That's a resting bowl available on the forehand, John. What does he play? Forehand draw to the green or backhand runner on the for the jack? Because he has got the best back bowl, but you know, if it's a runner, he needs to bury it. Yeah, he's got to get a jack on the backhand side. This is not nice at all for Simon yeah. Skelton. The other shot is to draw to that last bowl of Wayne Wildress and try and rest it. Trouble well, is, he hasn't played that side this end. No, Swapping last bowl. He could play the forehand, just, as you say, just rest the ball, turn the jack, but, you know, 50-50 choice. Playing the backhand. He has to be running it if he's playing the backhand. He'll be playing through it, I think. Yeah, it has to be. Wow. He's going for the draw again. Slightly narrower line. He's not not far away with this. Not oh, far Wayne, away Wayne's depends. clapping it. Wayne is clapping it. Is it enough? Could be. <laughs> <laughs> Simon thinks it is. Well. Whoa. I don't think Wayne's going to concede. He's got a bowl to go. <laughs> Definitely not going to concede. Really? He's not playing it. Oh, he must he's be, declared must, the end. He must be confident. Wow. Must be confident. Well, Simon's asking for the measure right away, but I hope Wayne's eyes are as good as he thinks they are. Yeah, because he, must be, he must be confident. He must be really confident not to play his last bowl. Well, he didn't even ask Francis, now you're allowed to do that. He could have asked Francis who's lying. Measure for shot. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I think, I think oh. Simon... Well, he just indicated the us, didn't he? not confident, yeah. He doesn't fancy confident, it. Yeah. 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 He doesn't fancy it. Yeah. yeah. It's one of those ones you don't want to walk away from, but you're not confident, especially with the quality of the umpires that are here. Yeah. They're not going to make a mistake. I think if there was any doubt, he wouldn't have wouldn't have done that way. He'd have played his last bowl. I think he feels it's his, and I think Simon believes that as well. I can understand it because he didn't want to tap the red ball yeah. with a mistake. Yeah. You know, so yeah, it's, 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 it's definite. Yeah, there was no mistake on yeah. that. There we go. There it is. And Wayne Wilgress, there's the body language now. He knew he had that game won. Didn't play his last ball. He got it on the measure, but the measure was well in, John. I have to say, entertaining stuff. Yeah, great game of balls. Good fun to watch. Good entertainment. Top stuff. Bit of drama as well, Dave. Oh, we had lots of drama. <laughs> no doubt about that. Especially in the first set. But the quality was top class. Good support from the crowd, lots of noise. Wayne Wilgress, he's always good value, isn't he? One way or another, he's going to give you full entertainment. And not only that, but he acknowledges all that emotion as well, John. He gives it, he gives it absolutely 100% all the time. Yeah, credit to both players. Wayne's going to be chuffed with that. They were bound to win sometime, weren't they, the Canaries? Uh, Canaries on a high tonight. Well, Wayne Wilgus will be just sucking this atmosphere up, and so he should. Oh, he absolutely did a mercurial thing to win the first set uh, with two threes at 8 7. Drew it, 8 all in the second. But Wayne Wilgus will through to play Mark Dawes, and that is a little bit tasty. Tomorrow morning, join us then for Paul Foster against Catherine Redknoll at 10.